I have to comment on Giannis's fake handshake offered to Jalen Brown after Giannis had decked Jalen Brown with an elbow, an obvious and dangerous offensive foul. Then down at the other end of the court, Giannis appeared to want to make peace. Giannis extended his right hand. And as Jalen went to shake it, Giannis pulled it back and ran it back through his hair, the classic psych ploy that kids do to each other. Psych. That's why Jalen Brown, after the game, called Giannis a child. That move was definitely childish. Giannis said, well, that's something he would do with his kids, yet that Giannis was the point. He, he wasn't playing around with his kids. He had just thrown a dangerous elbow into Jalen Brown's face. Giannis argued that, oh, he just tries to play the game with joy, fun. But the point is, Giannis is no longer having fun because the Bucs are 2-8, and eight, and his fake handshake was completely out of character because it was a jerk move. Giannis was, pardon my language, just being a real asshole. Losing can do that to you. I mean, he's just trying to make light of something that you can't make light of. Because this season is crumbling for Giannis. And yet, I first guessed this one. Giannis campaigned, this is going back a year ago, a year plus ago. Giannis campaigned for the Bucks to trade for Damian Lillard. And I said, be careful what you wish for Giannis. But no, the Bucks effectively traded Drew Holiday for Dame. And as I warned, they traded away their defensive identity. Dame plays little to no defense. And as you know, Drew Holiday is the guts and glue was of the Bucks defense and is of the Celtics defense. Everywhere he goes, winning happens, championships happen. Hmm. No coincidence. Dame was much better playing for a pretty good small pond team in Portland without a whole lot of attention on him, without much expectation. But it doesn't work Dame playing for the Bucks, who fairly recently did win an NBA championship. And I've said this before, and I'm going to say it again. Dame's clutchness, Dame time, is way overrated. Yeah, he's had a couple of playoff moments, especially that walk-off bomb he hit against Russell Westbrook in Oklahoma City when they were mad at each other and going mano a mano, and he was so inspired that he hit a big walk-off. But the overall playoff numbers, I won't bore you with them now. I'll go deeper into it later. The overall playoff numbers don't scream clutch for Dame the way all the ads he's done nationally scream clutch. And now that the world is watching and expecting, Dame's numbers are falling and Giannis is fake handshaking and wondering whatever happened to his championship bucks. Hmm.